Welcome to the Peter Plantation. As you can see, this is the view going up through the coconuts to the hydroponics and one of the main grazing paddocks. As I'm sure a lot of you are aware if you've watched my videos, the Peter Plantation is still an active cattle and copper plantation. So the copper cutters, that's cutting the coconut and all those piles of what we call dirty, which is the waste and cleaning up the plantation. But it's just so nice when the plantation's clean and the coconuts are gone. Especially for me because I ride motorbikes and hitting a coconut up with the front wheel of your motorbike is disastrous. Um, both Sean and I have come unstuck a number of times, but it does really does look pretty in the mornings when it's nice and clean. The only downside of having a coconut plantation is the bloody coconuts. So good morning from the Peter Beach. Here you can see one of our main grazing paddocks. And as we span round, you'll see you get the size of it. The coconuts across there, hydroponics in the background, and the bush paddock off to the side. Now you can see an aerial view with the mix between the bush and the coconuts with the barge picking up the cattle. Um, all the cattle at the Peter are picked up by barge by David Russo, so you've got a constant supply of cattle going down to Port Vila and regular buyers, which is um, a really good asset to have for the plantation. As you can see, the cattle yards are functional and in good order. Now we do a run along the coastline. You can see through the edge of the coconut grove, everything on the right hand side is what's for sale. The hydroponics has become a big part of Lapita and it's probably the most profitable part per square metre on the entire plantation. Um, we've got an established market with the LCM and the township of Luganville. So we deliver into town three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. One of the main reasons I live here is mornings like this. It's nice and cool, the cattle in the paddock, all nice and quiet, and coming around. Not a spectacular sunrise, but nonetheless, it's still beautiful. It makes it all worth it. Just down below, you can see the double story building at 440 square metres. As we follow the cattle race down, which also follows um, the public road around the corner and into the cattle yards. From the cattle yards, we just have a timber cattle race, which goes straight down to the barge for loading. The Peter Plantation is for sale as a walk-in, walk-out basis. Um, my son and I have been running the farm for the last few years and we've decided it's time for a move. There's plenty of potential there in the future by clearing extra paddocks, expending the hydroponics. It's a great investment for the right person that wants that island lifestyle and be in a rural setting.